Right here we are, hole number seven. I mentioned needing to play this a little bit different, but if you do want to see that other shot, I almost made it with a QB. So do check that guide out. It's going to be a good strategy. That's typically, um, you know, a way that I've played it. Oh, you know what? I forgot to bring my Guardian. Well, no, you know what? I think I only have a Guardian 7 on this account. You really need a Guardian 8. So I'm just going to switch to my bag that has the Cataclysm. You really, you'll want to do this with a Guardian, but I'm going to have to use Cataclysm because I don't have enough Guardian to be able to get that full 179. So if I can't put it at 179, we're going to use the 180 of Big Dog or Cataclysm just to create that extra range. But do keep that in mind, that Guardian, you'll want to use the Guardian for the accuracy boost. Now what I'm going to do, so I can extend my range well into this, you can see with how I'm doing. And then other than that, we'll just need to try to master this ball guide offset so you can see with where I'm trying to land. So typically we're talking nine, 10, almost seven rings for this ring adjustment. Uh, I'm gonna need to go maybe almost eight rings. You gotta do a little bit of an overplay. Shooting down on this hole. So I am overplaying almost eight rings. As I mentioned, that's still not enough. So as you can see, ooh, it actually rolls down into the sand. As I mentioned, we'll do that with a Guardian, but there needs to be an overplay. As you can see, I almost went eight rings. I probably needed to go eight and a half, but I needed to get a starting point. Uh, it will get easier once you, you know, get honed in on that adjustment. Uh, you know, I needed kind of a starting point more than anything. Also keep in mind, playing that wind effect is gonna be hard. You're gonna have to offset that guide. It's gonna look kind of awkward hanging out there to the right. But I also was probably still another almost full ring light there. So with that little bit extra ring adjustment, probably one extra ring, um, you know, that does substantially kind of change my ring play. What, what does that put me? Almost close to 10 rings there. What's that one point? It was like 1.2 per ring. So it's a very, it's a very intense overplay there that you need to play. It's like plus 40% or something on your max ring number. Um, so similarly, you need to do with that, that with Guardian. So it wouldn't even be, if you had the Guardian 8, that's what you would want to use for that shot. And in terms of a ring play, you're probably looking somewhere in the neighborhood of maybe 0 0.8, 0 0.85 per ring. So if the wind's 10 miles per hour, well, no, it wouldn't be 10, but let's say it's 11 miles per hour, uh, you know, you may want to be going 14-ish rings on a uh, Guardian 8 just to put you in the ballpark there. So keep that in mind. Good luck with that hole, guys, and see you on the next one.